Hi, welcome to all. Welcome to Street Zero Live. Uh, now we are going to see the solar panel sizing for one location. I hope uh, you have seen uh, many videos uh, which are uploaded for the solar related uh, almost couple of days, I guess. So now we are going to see the solar panel selection for this particular area. Uh, that's the location will be the Hyderabad. Hyderabad it's in India. It's located in uh, Telangana district. The exact location will be in IMAX mall near to the NTR garden. Here we have considered the latitude to be 17.41 and longitude would be 78.46. So that's the exact locations where we are going to tell you that uh, what solar panels required for particular location for certain loads. Okay, here you have to be very clear. Uh, this reading is for the loads which we have considered. If you are considering extra load or if you are considering very lower load, uh, then your system will be not be uh, suitable for your applications. Uh, the result would be the, some losses in terms of budget, or if you are you are spending extra amount. That's the reasons. So now we are going to see that I hope you have you you guys have understand the, what are the things related to solars like how it has to be selected. Uh, it's not uh, based on the uh, like uh, kilowatt or kV whatever it is. It's purely it, you have to select the systems so it's based on the units required. It's not in the day, not in the month. You have to be calculated for a year, and you have you have to forecast for next five year or ten year. So if you are designing the system for 10 year or 20 year you have to select the system accordingly so that units you are going to get what you are going to generate now so now uh, we have considered all the losses so, you know we have taken the records for the past couple of year and we are just forecasting based upon the past predictions and then we have sized those panels okay so you know that how to make the systems so many of uh, people have already installed the solar you may not knowing the systems like how much units you are getting from the systems and some uh, people may have an idea to go with the systems with designs with the solar but uh, uh, you are not able to get the more details on the system so probably you can put a mail to us we will clarify to your requirements uh, so here I will tell you that uh, what we have considered for this location that's in Hyderabad uh, near to NTR garden yeah here uh, we'll tell you that uh, it's uh, 25 watts load we have considered for four numbers eight hours operation per day 10 watts load stole numbers eight hours operation per day 100 watts loads four numbers 10 hours per day 100 watts loads one number six hours per day 50 hours loads one number eight hours per day each it's all the duty operation of 100 percent uh, so uh, it's it's assumptions mode we have concerns so probably one person initials may need this kind of uh, loads yeah, i'm going to tell you that we have not considered any of the air conditioner geyser or even the motor or any other heavy higher loads like uh, which you may use in the future applications uh, so we have taken all the uh, loads moreover what they are using the daily applications so if you are raising the system for the residential or the commercial or even the industrials probably you can uh, go through all the calculations so that uh, it will be very helpful for all of guys so these are the calculations okay and then we have sized for this uh, system here we have considered all the system losses and uh, what are the ratings required for this calculations uh, due to the climates so with the weather everything uh, we have considered even the summer winter rainy etc and then uh, this system has been uh, designed with the uh, radio panels as per the standards okay so if you are going going with the systems like planning uh, if you are planning for the uh, panels you just better go with the uh, panels with the proper ratings so that uh, you will not lose your pockets and then uh, so we have considered the panels with the, all the criteria basically as you said in previous uh, uh, videos <coughs> sorry so all the factors has been considered here the engineering factor 50 60 characteristics has been considered here so with our systems so here uh, oh, this is the header but right so you need to 
uh, based upon these calculations, it's almost uh, it comes uh, 2,454 units. Uh, according to this calculation, has to, you have to generate from the solar panels. So you have doubts what kind of panels, what would the ratings you have to go with that. So go with the polycrystalline, the standard one, which is the cost effective. So according to these systems, uh, so we have uh, considered uh, all the criteria. So we search. We suggest to go with that uh, 2600 WP panels, 2600, yeah, 2600 WP panels, so that you can achieve this load. Uh, it will be very good. And uh, so, uh, see these ratings we have considered the early basis. So, when you have the summer, summer, you may have a more generations. When you have a winter or any, the units generated will be lesser. So, so we have taken the entire units calculations so how much units going to generate from the system so ultimately you have to see that so many people think so uh, no no or just rain, rainy season it's a cloudy of course we have considered all the design criteria all the weather conditions the cloudy um, uh, yeah, even the fog conditions uh, even the temperature rating surface temperatures etc okay even the wind pressures not many things we have considered in the systems to design the solars perfect way yeah so you know many experts are you know are there in this everywhere they're doing the systems still they may have the, some doubts on the systems how they want to make it perfect things probably you can put a email to three solar life at gmail.com we'll come back to you on the systems what do you like to clarify we we'll clarify your doubts I hope uh, this videos you may have uh, uh, you have clarified I mean we have clarified uh, some points Maybe some people have already doubt on the systems. I hope these videos clarify all your points. So if you have any points, please let us know. Uh, and thank you for watching this video. Please share this videos to your friends again. Thank you for watching this video. And I'm going to put a lot many videos for other state and district even for the countries. Uh, please watch the video. Thank you. Bye.